Do you ever feel like the universe is trying to tell you something? Hi, I'm Reverend Ellie Bierman. I'm so glad that you came by here today for our gathering of Metaphysical Ministry International. What's a metaphysical ministry? It's all about the fact that what you observe using only your five senses really accounts for less, less than 1% of what exists in your universe. So, when you learn how to move beyond your five senses and open yourself to the fact that other dimensions exist, your life will become so much richer. So, the last few weeks, the universe has reminded me that indeed, while being a divine spirit, I do live in a human body that has very real physical needs. I was doing a huge huge project. It actually has taken me eight months so far and I've got maybe another month left finishing it up and delivering all the gifts and the donations that came in. So I was working nearly around the clock because you know what? I love what I do. I love making a difference in people's lives. I love reaching as many people as I can. And I wasn't ever tired. I was just go, 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 go all those months. And then when the donation period ended, the universe said, okay, let's hold on here. We're going to take a little while before delivering the gifts. And what happened was all the nerve damage I had that causes me to lose my voice, that causes me to have trouble swallowing, causes me to have trouble just moving my body because I get very sick from acid issues. It all came like, <laughs> not gradually, but boom. Pow! Hit me really hard. And for a week, I couldn't do much of anything except lie still. And now, hey, I have a voice so I can make this video for you. That's why I haven't seen you recently. Anyway, the thing is, one of my friends said, I'm sorry you're having a setback. And I thought, it's not a setback. It's just the universe giving me a wake-up call. And in fact, it's given me the call in a very gentle way whisper because I've learned to hear the gentle whispers and I didn't need to get knocked for a loop with a nudge that pulled me over. So I paid attention. I'm doing the resting. I'm not working all day and all night anymore. I'm making sure I relax. I enjoy myself. Make sure I eat enough because when I work I forget to eat. Making sure I drink enough. I always measure my water. Everything that my body needs, I'm doing it because the universe told me to do that. Because unless I'm in 100%, how can I be of any service to anybody? Now, we usually start every week with a happy share. So I'm going to share my happy share right now. My happy share, kind of obvious, I can talk. I had lost my voice. And it's harder for me to talk than it has been for a long time. But I can talk, and you can hear me. I'm very, very grateful about that. So how do you look at your world when you're going along, and all of a sudden something doesn't turn out the way you want to? Do you look at it as a setback? Or do you look at it as time to pull back? Maybe I need to step in a different direction. Maybe I need to change my perspective. The choice is yours. I wish you a week filled with many blessings and real insight into what's going on in your world such that you get to move forward every single day.